this is what you're saving yourself by using tubs first, the first couple rounds. There's aphids and dirt. I had oak leaves I pulled out of there. It's pretty gross. And so, unless you want to call a plumber at the end of the week, don't use your sink. In the second round, it was already looking much cleaner. Third round will look great, and then we'll bring it in the house. Hey, bud, you watch that, okay? Babysit it for me. As you can see, I'm on the move, just little small streets, a couple streets I'm going. So I wanted to talk to you about a very simple topic today, but important topic, okay? And we get asked, Buddy and I get asked all the time, we're out in the yard or we're out somewhere and people see the vegetables in the garden, they go, can I buy your extras? And I'm like, nope, 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 nope. First of all, I don't want the government to be, you know, I don't want to pay taxes. I don't want to talk to the IRS or nothing. No, this is an opportunity for you and me to bless somebody. If you have excess in your garden, the best thing you can do is go out and lay your treasures up in heaven and build relationships and not try to get just a couple bucks for your things. Now, I don't put down people who do. Some people do it very well, small business. I have a small business, but um, for me, this is not where I've been called to um, put my extra food so what I have been called to do is to go out and build relationships with people and this is a good way to talk to people so I give it to friends I um, I make peace with my neighbors right that's a good thing and uh, they're happy to see the garden out there the chickens clucking and, and what have you and even when buddy runs away which is rare but it ha has happened when he was little um, you know it makes them a little bit nicer to you. So the other thing I've been thinking about is I have a lot of lettuce and I can't store my lettuce. It counts okay a little bit. Some things only store for so long. And uh, I got to thinking about that. This is the best way to bless your community. Take your extra, go the extra mile. Clean it, chop it, bag it. Take it to a food pantry or homeless ministry. That is the best thing you can do um, to serve your, your fellow man, really. Um, it, it's so simple and it's gonna put a lot of smile. I don't know how many opportunities they get, uh, especially the homeless, to have fresh food. So um, this would be just a, a wonderful thing. And I'm doing it right now, that's what you're seeing. We're taking our extras to our church's food bank. So uh, I am so extremely happy to do this and um, it's just put a smile on my face all morning long. So um, Bud and I, we're going to go deliver it. So uh, we're delivering it on Thursday, so it'll be totally ready for Saturday because church is closed Friday. So this is just perfect and be a blessing to somebody. That's all I'm saying, be a blessing. We need more kindness out there in the world today. Love you, bye. looking really good for mahi and um, fishing, offshore fishing, trolling, you name it, bottom fishing. Pretty soon grouper season's going to open up, so be watching for the next couple videos. I bet we'll have fish in them. Okay, we'll talk to you later. Bye. Mm -hmm.